Hello and welcome. This is your boy Jack here to do another reaction video. This time I'll be reacting to two artists that I haven't had the pleasure of listening to, reacting to, or listening to. I know I said that twice, but yes, uh, this is Laycon and V. I'm not quite sure if that's how it's pronounced. I think it's V E E I Y E. So I'm saying V. If that's wrong, please let me know in the comments down below. That'll be absolutely awesome uh so the track i'll be reacting to is titled enter my head i'm curious to hear what this is all about and let uh, watch this artists these two artists showcase their talent so without further ado let's get this reacting party started this is the enter my head featuring lakin okay lakin has been featured in this track all right so let's do this Ah, it's got the Afro beat going for it. All right. I love the quality. But, but, bust up your speaker. Only one leader. I fuck that shit up, then I light up a reefer. <laughs> bust up your speaker. Okay. Um, only one leader. Leader. Light up a reefer. All right, I, I get you. And she's like, all right, all right. Sorry, just take a little bit further back there to the beginning. She started out strong. Let's see if she keeps the flip. But but bus up your speaker. Only one leader. I fuck that shit up, then I light up a reefer. V B your teacher. Number one pleaser. I'm on my bossy shit. Okay, she's on her bossy. I get dough, then I flip that quick. If you don't like me, you can suck my <laughs> These days, nice. man, damn, wanna come close But I stand on ten toes, suck sun, man, scone These days, some women wanna turn foes But I got God flow, sing bows, fuck hoes hey. <laughs> I love that, alright, I love the laid-back rap It actually works with the beat And so it's very interesting I wonder if that's his style Or if it's just him adapting to this particular strike, I love the lyrics because it's got flow, <laughs> sucking on ten toes. Did he say stepping on ten toes? I'm sorry. Let's just take it back again a bit, and we'll continue from there. These days, man, damn, wanna come close, but I stand on ten toes, suck sun, man, scold. These days, some women stand on ten toes, but I got God flow, sing bows, fuck hoes. Hey, all hands on deck. See, I never pick a fight, cause my hands full. Now I'm the type to say, walk out to you, hit us with a high five, Pepe never. I love that whole, I never pick a fight. I'm the type to say, um, but wait, wait, what did he say? Hold on. Sing boots, fuck hoes. Hey, all hands on deck. See, I never pick a fight cause my hands full. Now never pick a fight cause my hands full. You hit us with a high five, Pepe never. I just have to say walk out to you haters with a high five. Walk out means, you know, walk out is actually a curse. Um, if I'm not mistaken, well, I'm not mistaken. I know it's a curse in Niger. I think a Nigerian other uh, certain African countries actually still use that too. Um, I love the whole, you know, he was stuck up by his hands and he ended up using the high five and using that as a curse. And it's like his hand is full. He's, he's too busy with his hands full to actually try to get into your situation with other people. So he was like, you know what, give you a high five. And <laughs> at the same time, you can use that as an insult. Brilliant. Okay, so he's basically talking about his life, that no one told him what to expect, things are going great, and he's hoping that the um, the fame doesn't actually get into his head and turn him into something else. So that's actually a commendable goal, especially a lot of people who actually suddenly achieve fame really sometimes they forget who they are and let things get out of control and they end up worse off than when they actually started, even with the fame. So... Brilliant. I'll say you know, enter my head. I'll say you know, enter my head. As my 
mind if I G's done? Would they still want me here? Or will I still be scared of this? Yo, see, I no go lie. Me, I came prepared. I was hustling for days, facing all my fears. Because um, I don't know. Okay, so basically it's like, I've been doing this for a while. I've known I've been facing my fears. So she's asking, is she, she going to be, if people are still going to li like her if she, after her fame is gone? But, and he's like, you know, I've been doing this for quite some time. I'm here. I'm prepared. And I hustle to get here. And I know how to get, keep my, my shit tight, basically. All right. So let's just take it back. I'll tell you no end of my head. Cause when the fudge is done, would they still want me here? Or will I still be scared of this? Yo, you see, I no go lie. Me, I came prepared. I was hustling for days, facing all my fears. Um, Cause I don't know who's got my back, so I keep my defense. Make them no come attack. Go ahead, yeah. come attack. Oh, look what they on God. God body, God gummy. I'll be here till I'm done. Uh, I like that. They were going back and forth, so she's asking. Would people still be there? Um, she doesn't know who to trust, but he was like, I got your back and I'm going to be there for you and whatever. And also the fact that he was talking about, um, he's been hustling for so long that he knows how to keep his focus. And I'm guessing in a way she, he's actually trying to come tell her, look, whatever happens, if things fade, I'm going to be there for you. You don't need to worry. Just do your thing. So that's great. I wonder if they actually know each other because it seems a bit personal. I looked a little bit like Mary J. Blige there in the red. All right, that was V or V. I'm gonna say V. Uh, featuring Lakan, and the track is "Enter My Head." That's actually really nice, really nice song. Really enjoyed it. I thought a really positive message. You know, it was like talking about doing things that would benefit them and not let anyone else come along and try to mess things up, mess things up for them. So I really, I really do subscribe to that message. It's like, you gotta do your thing. Yes, things might get tough. This might be weird. The people out there, you can't really trust them. Find those who you actually trust, those who got your back and make sure you keep them close and soldier on because ultimately you gotta do you, you gotta trust yourself. And without that, with that, Sky's the limit, so to speak. So that was V featuring Lakon, and the track was Enter My Head. I really liked it. I love the chill vibe and I love the message it sends out there. And I was curious, yes, do they actually know each other? Because it seems a bit more personal. Like this is an affirmation of the friendship or something like that, which is quite interesting. I don't really see that often in music. I might be wrong. I might be reading it into things but that's the feeling i got from that and if it's the case then that's great if it's not then they're absolutely fantastic and they did a fantastic job conveying that sentiment without actually doing so without actually meaning it. so it doesn't really matter fantastic song i can't wait to actually check out more stuff from lacon and v and till then this is your boy jack don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to hit the notification button. Let you know when next is dropping your vid. Don't forget to leave comments down below. Let me know what you think. Let me know what you want me to react to. If you've got nothing to say, just say, hey, that's absolutely okay. If you disagree with what I've said during this reaction video, or wish to expand on what I've said during this reaction video, please don't hesitate to let me know in the comments down below. All I ask is that you be constructive about it. And with that said, this is your boy, Jack. Y'all take care, and I will catch you on the flip side.